Buju ani bangishimo nindijna kaz kuchiching no indinjaba. Makwa do dem. My English name on my status card is Sean Johnson. And I'm originally from Kuchiching, First Nations, which is located in Northern Ontario. And I've been residing in Kitchener-Waterloo for about eight years now and living in downtown Kitchener. I'm a Two-Spirit Land Defender, co-founder of Land Back Camp, and also a photographer in the community. Land Back Camp was founded in June of 2020 uh, with Ter Chartrand and Amy Smoke. The three of us took it upon ourselves to reclaim space in downtown Victoria Park uh, for four months and then we later moved on to Waterloo Park uh, and then the camp was uh, put into hibernation just before Christmas time. Uh, during that time I actually started working on a series of portraits called Land Back Camp, Our Voices. Uh, it wasn't intended to become a portrait series but it did. I wanted to take pictures of all the campers involved to bring more attention to the camp and why all these youth, why all these indigenous queer, two-spirit youth were a part of the camp and to use my photography as a way for them to share their stories, to share their voices with the, with the bigger community. So I started sharing those pictures and their stories through social media and it actually just um, got a lot of attention. And the next thing you know, it actually did, it did turn into a portrait series and that's been uh, featured in a number of spaces and throughout Kitchener Waterloo, which has been amazing. Um, the piece behind me now is of Amy Smoke and Sky Smoke, their daughter, uh, who are two of the co-founders of the camp. And uh, it is another picture, continuation of the series. And uh, I'm actually quite proud of this picture, really. It speaks to the new space. It speaks to the continued work that we're doing in Laurel Creek. This year, we're in Laurel Creek Conservation Area, uh, reclaiming space there for the summer. And it really speaks to the need for creating space like Sky uh, for the next generation, for youth to have a space to gather, and what and the work that we're doing and why it's so important. So I'm really and and it's just convenient that. The piece is directly across from Kitchener City Hall. And the work that we've done um, is a message that reconciliation needs to continue happening. We need to keep having these conversations with the folks in City Hall, with the folks in the region. Uh, so I think it's quite appropriate that the piece is where it is, uh, just because it's a reminder for the folks in City Hall that there is so much more work to do with Indigenous folks in the Indigenous community. The biggest thing that we've learned from last year and this year is that our presence, being Indigenous, makes people uncomfortable. And I hope that this is a reminder that we are here, we have always been here, we've been here for thousands of years, um, and it's time that the cities and that the region step up to start to continue working with us. Um, we want space, we want land, we want a place to gather, and that's what we're doing right now in Laurel Creek Conservation Area. Thank you so much to Kafka for providing me with this opportunity to showcase some of my work here in downtown Kitchener. And you can follow me at nationsandvoices.com, and you can also support the camp at landbackcamp.com. Thank you for tuning in, and we'll see you soon. Miigwech.